What do you feel like has been the biggest key to this team's early success? I think that we're best friends on and off the court, so it makes a big difference. Um, just being able to tell them, like, pick them up, not always in the nicest way. It means more when it's coming from someone you're closer with, I think, so. Yeah. You're settling in with the new coach, Coach Schultz. Um, what has that transition been like so far? Um, it's been easy for the most part. I mean, there's always going to be different stuff with new coaches. Um, but I think it was needed just to refresh. And, yeah, it feel, it's pretty good so far. <laughs> good deal. Well, as a senior for this team, just how are you leading and trying to set an example, a good example for this team? Um, you know, trying to always pick them up. It, like, there's a lot of younger girls who don't play clubs, so you always got to, like, know, they have to know that you will be there for them and help them, and you always just want to set a good example. So, yeah. Knowing you have those wins over Belmont and Angola, two teams that know a thing or two about going on deep postseason runs in 3A, how much of a confidence booster is that for this team? Uh, I think it's a big one because the past few years we – haven't had the best games with them, and it's helped a lot, I think, just knowing that we can really compete with any other team and we have a chance. Knowing there's still a long way to go in this season, you have yet to play an SAC match. Yeah. Uh, just how do you try to carry this momentum forward over the next several weeks? Um, I feel like just e each week at a time, you got to take it one step at a time each game. So if we're able to do that, I feel like we could do really good this season. Good deal. Jillian, anything else you want to add that I haven't asked already? No, I don't think so.